nerfing our stuff through the GAN. And look what I have. Mega Centurion unboxing, not review, because I have to test it first, then I'll do the review. So I'm going to start unboxing it. We'll see, well, before we take it out, if you look here, um, on the box, it has this range thing here. I don't know, I can't understand it, but then there's this accessory, which we'll get to in just a minute. First, let's take out the Centurion. I'm very excited. That's the actual size, supposedly. We'll see. And well, and I've got an Elite Dart, and I'll show you why in a moment when I get this thing open. I think it's upside down. All right, there we go. Beautiful new Nerf smell. Oh, let's get this. Oh my gosh! And it comes with this plastic wrap, which I think they should do with all because it protects it in the casing. Beautifully cut through plastic, and here we have it. Oh my gosh! I guess you can't pull the trigger when there's no mag in. And let's get this huge magazine out. I've seen these on YouTube and also Nerf Wiki. They just don't look as big as they are. This is the mega clip. This is bigger than a 50 caliber round. Um, this is like a 25, maybe even 30 millimeter. As usual, big sniper rifles are 20 millimeter, 50 cals. Here are the darts. Wow, they're really cool. Let's open them, please. So, here's the dart. You can put your pinky in them. And where's that? Okay, so elite darts, you, put, you can put them right in like this. They fit exactly like it. But, you, and you can put it all the way in. However, if you get one of these, never fire it with the Elite Dart in it. It will jam the gun, maybe even permanently. So never do that. It's not smart. So let's put this, these darts in this huge magazine. I think you have to push them down and then put them in. I don't think really. And they say they're Whistler darts. They scream through the air, as they say. Mega darts scream through the air. And we'll put these in. I'm wondering what other Nerf Mega Series weapons they're going to make. This is about the size of a 12 round clip. Can hardly, okay, there we go. And as you know, probably, that once you put the front barrel on, which is here. Oh, and then we got the bipod, of course, which is here. Here's the bipod, and we'll get to that in a minute. This is the barrel, and it goes right on the front like this. But if you don't want your Centurion to have that, never put it on because it's not coming back off. You have to. You can get it off, but you have to get inside of it somehow. At, at least I think. But just don't. If you don't want them on. Don't put it on, though I recommend putting it on for accuracy. And the range doesn't really change. Let's see, bottom rail and the top rail here. I'm putting it on. Here it goes. It's not coming off. Not coming off. This thing is long. I think long as a long strike. I'll see, maybe even, maybe longer, but it seems shorter. I don't know. Nice stock uh, adapters, sling adapters here, here, and here. Here's the pegs. Let's get these open for charging it. Here we go. And I think they just go in those holes here and there. They snap in. I think. Okay. 
Well, let's try that. I don't want to force it, but I think that's what you have to do. Does it matter which one's going? I'll see. Oh, okay. Let's... Oh, there we go. That sounds like it. Wait a minute. Oh my god, that's hard. But I need to put some weight on it. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'll have to get that on later. But anyways, G jamming door is here. And it does drop without that other bolt. At least I think it does. Wow. And that's a foot long draw, even longer. Where's that mag? Where did I put that thing? Here it is. So the bolt has to be forward to put this ginormous clip in. Let's see. Okay. It's embarrassing. So don't I don't wanna force it. Maybe it doesn't maybe right, let's just Wow. Oh, and then, I don't think it can be charged. You have to have it uncocked uh, to go. Front and rear sights, if you look down here, through here. Tactical rail, tactical rail. Let's look at this bipod. into position and slides right on, leap being in the front. There is your Mega Centurion Sniper Rifle. This is the ultimate Nerf Sniper Rifle. And the bipod you can put on a Stampede or Rapid Strike, which you'll see in the next review which I got today. So I saw on the picture the guy's prone sniping. This is amazing. This is like a Brett craziness. There's a de-jamming de door. Mag release is here. Um, there you have it. So, I think I'm going to do this accessory in the next review. You'll see it's something that you can put your iPhone in and an app. Um, but you'll see that in the next review. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you.